What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, like, and subscribe. Share this channel with somebody. Don't go into nothing, baby. No matter who or what, or why. Just share the channel with somebody, man. Uh, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Since I first heard this song, it, it, I don't know what it is. Bro has to be like an industry plant or something because I can't get this song on my head. And it's another thing I can't do. I can't put down the cup. I can't put down the cup. But apparently he is in, in trouble right now. So I'm just... really not trying to be funny here, but Dave Blunt's life is really at risk, okay? You can literally see it. Mind you, he's sitting down. Bro, gotta down put the cup down. Okay? When it's to the point where it's like you can't move, you can't get up, you can't walk, yeah, you can't do anything. So Snoop Dogg commented on a random post and said, well, put down the chicken wings and chips, nephew, and that chair gonna break soon. You know, I made a video about Dave Blunts about six months ago before the dude even had like 40K monthly listeners trending on TikTok with his first few songs, you know? And it was only a matter of time after I made that vid, the dude career really just took off. He didn't got so many cosigns from multiple Your health rappers, matters. singers, Your just health celebrities is the most in general, important which I've been seeing for life. these past few months. Remember that. Been really making a name for himself because you don't got your health right now people really see you're not gonna make it to 100 plus years of like that 2021 2022 sound you know what i'm saying that was low-key trendy with the whole rage beats and stuff and for the past few months he's also released two projects one of them is called well dude here's my thing and the other one that just released is called if i could i would and the good thing is that he's been performing not just his biggest songs but he's been branching out to build connections to perform with people who already have a name and it's crazy because you really can't escape dave blunts on TikTok. Talk. I mean, he's trending everywhere, bro. Right now, everybody keeps seeing it that they can't put down the cup, so I know y'all been seeing it. But here's the thing. With all the success he's been having for the last, like, six months, right, there's something that just doesn't matter. I ain't gonna lie to you know, y'all. Like, ain't this what I'll be telling myself, too. Say this, and that's Why do okay, people, but I think this needs to be like, said get so things. rich, Could so famous, you know? so and like then they this. just when you think mess about it all up, ruin it. What's the first two things that come to mind? I already like, know what you finna say. You're rich, you're famous. Put the cup down. Put the drink down. You know what I'm saying? Almost make your money, live your life, think about your generation, your generation, generation of world. Don't even know if he's serious because he's having it so much that every time he posts that he's in the hospital, down. some people laugh at him, but most of his fans are telling him, bro, like if you're actually sipping or you on these drugs like you say you are or whatever, you need to stop. And with him being overweight, it's definitely not gonna help. You know what I'm saying? And y'all might think I'm joking until I start actually showing y'all the stuff that I'm talking about. So here we are. So this right here is Dave Blunt's first performance ever, okay? And then I'm gonna show y'all the aftermath right it's sad to see this I remember that show like my 500 pound like for whatever it's called. while performing this okay yeah I'm hearing that he sat down the whole time I'm gonna say another thing too this is why I'm not saying bring back bullying. I'm not even saying bullying, but like we gotta bring back being like hard on others, cause like being on all sensitive and soft, and trying to be build people egos all the time. It needs to stop like this. And then once you get like too far, you are a superstar. This is what you've been working hard for. I found yeah, out I'm just joking. He didn't say either, but he did give me a really good pet talk. Unfortunately, Jesse Jones wasn't there. He was on his own solo journey right now, and I don't know how long he'll be gone, but I do miss him, thankfully. Before Jesse Jones left, he was able to get rid of some garbage for me. Anyways, I have fun, and I can't wait to start doing more shows. Laughing emoji. He posted him performing again and said, I sat on stage and I couldn't stand me. And if you look at the comments, it's like people just skipping over the fact that he performed by sitting down, and no one for the new health at all. And only two people that were concerned were Lil Yachty and Snoop Dogg. So here's what Lil Yachty had to say about it. And he actually messaged Dave Blunts one on one through iMessages. And Yachty started off the conversation. He said, You gotta get in that gym, baby boy. Then Dave had responded. He said, Laugh out loud. You would think I was on a treadmill the way I ran on my bag. Then Yachty replied and said, Laugh out loud. Twin think it's a joke. And the first thing that Dave Blunts did was screenshot and post it on the screen. That's another reason I said it was a joke back then. Like, hard on people. They serious. take everything like, in his jokes. Game. Next, we have they Snoop Dogg. He has to say about this but <laughs> we just gonna read it man so snoop dog commented on a random post and said we'll put down the chicken everybody is giving you like signs and like telling you to calm down and just chill and dave once had responded like, and said damn to. and i heard they was going back and forth you're trying to keep like the that image because, you know like, dave once thought you know snoop dog sometimes was to be images aren't it's good to keep was to some funny, images you just got to let die but i'm hearing that snoop dog actually apologized today a little video about it so yeah and after you got your viral hit song got your thing, thing. Nah, I'll do it off better, of it. But then worse. You know what I'm saying? Because if you look closely.
closely, right? They once posted that he will be performing at Juice World Day on November 30th with Kodak, Yachty, Trippy, and Polo G. And that definitely sounds good. But the question is, how's he gonna do this again? Because we all seen how his last performance went, all right? Knowing that he finna have a performance in the next five to seven days, Dave Blunt's actually ended up in a hospital again. I don't know how. And the first thing that he did See, was he post on IG. And here's joke, what the caption said. He said, this week has been crazy. I found out I was performing at Juice World Day, so I decided to go to the doctor and make sure everything was okay. Then the doctor was like, uh, question mark, question mark. We gotta get you to the hospital. So I just been chilling here all week, resting and getting better. Nothing will stop me from performing at Juice World Day. The show must go on. Of course, I have to bring my studio equipment in here. You know the grind never stops. Laughing my ass off. But anyways, the doctor said I'll be okay. It's nothing too serious. I will be out here in time for the show. I didn't want to tell you guys because I know you guys worry about me a lot. And when y'all worry, y'all get to saying crazy shit in the comments. But I am okay. And I will perform no matter what. Heart emoji. Now, at this point, even though Dave Blunt I admire like okay, the passion and drive and all that stuff. Is okay, because clearly he needs to slow down, you know, focus on his health and yeah. stuff like that. But him and his team seem to be so focused on chasing a bag and building his I ain't gonna say which one, but one of those TikToks is my comment. By the way, his help. I'm really not trying to be funny here, but Dave Blunt's life is really. I ain't know I was gonna get seen. See it. I want you to watch this video, and this is after he performed at his first performance. Okay, Dave Blunt was on the brink of passing out backstage after performing while sitting on the chair. <laughs> Yeah, he looks uncomfortable. Bobble M said that Dave Blunt is finally working out. Is this actually him? Yo. Yeah. Bro, this ain't him. All right, I'm not watching this full thing, man. And I really think people just making a joke out of this whole thing because Dave Blunt don't even take himself serious. I don't even think he concerned for his own health, bro. Because if you look at his page, you look at his Spotify page, you look at all these different platforms that he's on, he's using it as an image. I'm not trying to say that he's flexing, that he's in a hospital, but bro. Bro, treat a life like you talking, got. Why is everyone no supposed to either him being in a hospital or bragging about his cup when we know that he's not healthy? That doesn't make sense. You know what I'm saying? And him and his team only pushing that because it's making him money you know what i'm trying to say bro and i'm not trying to stop dave blunt's grind because i really do respect him as an artist i really do think he's really good and i know i have a platform so i'm just using this to be like hey dave bro please go get help man i don't Sitting know what from you the that said, Yo, you're okay you don't have to worry about anything I can't you know, put down it. Look good right now can't you're, put bag. you're performing at juice world that song's so really catchy though that? nobody but it's gonna get to a point where you can't keep dragging this on bro for real and here's a message today just what check he said, I can't bro. put it on the camera. If you just check the comments of the everything that y'all been posting, bro, people are literally saying, yo, Dave Blunt needs help. And you know, he keeps saying that he can't put down a cup, but like, bro, you need to put down a cup, bro. This ain't a joke, man. But you know, it's not that much I can really say or do. And you know, Dave Blunt's a grown man. He gonna do what he wanna do. You know, and I'm not making this video to bash you or anything like that because I respect him as an artist and stuff like that. I respect his team. They didn't this show is like the generation we live in. Also letting you know, like, like nowadays, so people will much rather care about being famous than they do like just they help and just take care of themselves. Like people are just like Dirk said.